The planned six-month shoot took over five years. Noel Marshall thought he could film Roar in six months with a million budget. However, when lions are co-stars in a movie, chances are there are going to be complications. Marshall and his DP Jan de Bont were forced to film the scenes in a documentary style, oftentimes covering the action with eight Panavision 35M cameras. The scene where Marshall drives a jeep with lions riding in the back alone took two weeks of rehearsal. The film was also incredibly delayed, since actors frequently required hospitalization and natural disasters continued to destroy the sets. In the end, Roar took five years and cost million. Much of the movie ended up being personally funded by Marshall and Hedren after their financiers backed out. The film ended Tippi Hedren and Noel Marshall's marriage. Tippi Hedren and Noel Marshall got divorced in 1982, and Marshall's son John believes the disaster that was Roar had something to do with it. It was so intense. Melanie was Dad's stepdaughter, but it was Tippy's real daughter. For my father to keep putting her real daughter in that much jeopardy. Melanie, when she started this movie, was 17. Noel Marshall developed gangrene from countless fights. Noel Marshall developed gangrene from countless fights. A lion bit into John Marshall's head for 25 minutes. A lion bit into John Marshall's head for 25 minutes. Melanie Griffith's smalling is in the final cut. Noel Marshall put people's lives at risk to get shots. Noel Marshall put people's lives at risk to get shots. The actors feared for their lives. The actors feared for their lives. Noel Marshall and Tippi Hedren raised lion cubs in their house. Noel Marshall and Tippi Hedren raised lion cubs in their house. The shoot was a literal zoo. The shoot was a literal zoo. Hey guys, thank you so much for the support and likes and comments down below. And also thank you so much for watching and I look forward to see you in the next video then. Take care. Bye.